hello hello welcome back it's your girl magic mermaid and we're about to get into the leo um a march 2024 tarot scope reading for all my leo sun moon and rising signs okay and so i'm pretty shuffled so we're gonna get right into it and see what we have going on okay we have the knight of cups leo we have the Hierophant, okay, very nice. We have the Devil card, okay. We have the Ten of Wands. We have the Ace of Wands, okay. And we have the Queen of Cups. Let me shuffle once more and I will grab the Clarifiers. The Clarifiers. Uh, and you know what, guys? I'm going to make an adjustment. Just... Okay. There we go. Okay. So, clarifier for the Knight of Cups is the Eight of Cups. Okay. And then we have the Eight of Pentacles, clarifying the Hierophant. We have the Fool card, clarifying the Devil. And we have the Seven of Pentacles, clarifying the Ten of Wands. We have the Queen of Pentacles, clarifying the Ace of Wands. And then we have the Five of Swords, clarifying the Queen of Cups. Let's get the remainder of your cards. We have Authenticity, absolutely. We have Study, okay. We have Strength, okay. We have Justice, okay, awesome. We have Health, okay. And we have knowledge. Okay. So let's get right into it. We're starting off with the Knight of Cups clarified by the Eight of Cups. Okay. So the Knight of Cups clarified by the Eight of Cups is talking about Leo following your heart, walking away from something, leaving something behind. And then the Knight of Cups is talking about some sort of an offer. And so... I do feel like, Leo, this month in March, you are offering someone some sort of high-level commitment. Um, but also, I do feel like some of you could be leaving one company to go to another. That's what I feel like a little bit. Like, you may be getting one job offer and, you know, maybe it's more money or more pay somehow. You're leaving to go to another um, you know, organization, which is represented by the Hierophant card, clarified by the Eight of Pentacles. Eight of Pentacles is all about work, okay? So, yes, this makes me feel like there's another organization that's offering you, saying, look, Leo, you might be way better off if you come and work for us instead of this agency that you work for. And so... It does look like, Leo, that you will be taking the offer, but also there's a caution here. There's a warning. You have the devil card clarified by the fool, okay? So this is something new. This is a new journey, but also you may not be looking at the bigger picture of what all comes with this territory or what this entails of. You may have long, long, long hours or your schedule may change to a point where it's actually um, not, not benefiting you, okay? And you are not getting things done that you want to get things done. And so you can see that happening in your life. Leo, um, it's clarified by the full, uh, the full card. So I don't know. It's something new here. So there's a new relationship. So you could be meeting a Capricorn also, Leo. So let's not forget that a Capricorn or a Taurus person, Earth energy is strong here, clearly and obviously. So Capricorn, Virgo, or Taurus people may be relevant around you this month in March. But yeah, so. Um, this is a new situation, but I feel like whatever this is, it's not necessarily, you know, the greatest thing for you. Like, whatever this is, it may be, have an addiction essence to it. So, you know, you may be doing something this month where, you know, you're you're drinking too much or you may be indulging in some, some other DRUGSs um, outside of the usual things. Or, you know, you could just be spending a lot, a lot of money. But this is you 
This could be somebody being stuck in a toxic pattern or in a codependent relationship where it's like you're getting yourself into a situation that down the line is going to be really hard to dig yourself out of this hole that you're digging right now where it's like, oh my gosh, I'm going to put my entire life in your hands. I'm going to let you take care of my bills. I'm going to let you do this, this, and this and have all this control over me. And then when you get down the line and you figure out that you dug yourself into a hole, you're like, oh my goodness, now I have to undig myself. So just a message to be aware of. Okay. I will say, um, we have the 10 of wands. So clarified by the seven of pentacles just makes me feel like that you are doing a lot of work this um, month. So the devil can also be like a workaholic energy, like you're putting out a lot of work. Maybe that's just what needs to be done right now at the moment. But let's be aware not to make this a habit or our normal work schedule because that is not going to, you know, benefit you. Um, but this is also talking about you're doing work this month in uh, March to really work on your bad habits. You know, any toxic ways that really like put you behind any toxic ways that are not beneficial to you that they really just don't help you. They just, you know, put you in a worse spot than what you are, you know, when you're trying to move forward. And so you're really working hard and i love the seven of pentacles card because it's about doing hard work but also because it has the saturn on the card and we all know saturn is about discipline and you know kind of like consequences and reaping what you've sown and things like that so it's showing like you're falling from saturn saturn is you know causing you to come back down to earth and realize that you have responsibilities you have things that need to be taken care of and you need to be disciplined in getting these things done so that you can build yourself towards a better life, okay? We have the Ace of Wands clarified by the Queen of Pentacles. So, yes, you're doing all of this very hard, important work and then also you are starting a new project this month clarified by the Queen of Pentacles. So this could be a project that you're starting at home. So this could be you just really redecorating, you adding some new elements to your home. Maybe you're just sprucing things up. We are on the precipice of the energetic new year or the astrological new year, which is the actual new year when nature refreshes itself and is ready to start anew. And so you could feel yourself kind of in nesting mode. You know, if your body is in alignment with the energy of the earth, you might start nesting where you're cleaning up everything you're clearing things out you're giving th things away you're throwing things away you know you're you're getting rid of the old so that when the spring comes the newness can come in so that's a lot of the energy that i think you're having especially toward the end of march and then you have the queen of cups clarified by the five of swords which is you know when by any means necessary and so uh, i don't know with the queen of cups energy it's very like lover girl energy it's like wife energy some of you could be stepping into a higher level commitment this month you know taking your relationship to the next level taking it to a more committed level okay so that could be something that's happening but i really feel like this is a lot about career and doing you know some really intense inner work this month but the queen of cups i think towards the end of the month Leo, you are very satisfied with the work that you complete this month in March. You're like, look, it's not anybody else's calculation. It's my own calculation. And I feel like the work that I've done is definitely more than enough. And I've done an excellent job. So you're giving yourself some credit, some grace this month, which is good. So justice, everything is working in your favor for sure, for sure. Authenticity, you are being authentic to yourself this is about your health so this may be a little bit about what that devil card was talking about so be aware of that you know if you've had any health problems in the past this could be talking about those health problems could be coming up again this month and you're figuring out okay like i need to be more aware i need to be more efficient in like making sure i'm eating right making sure i'm putting the right things in my body making sure i'm listening to the right things and surrounding myself by the right people okay so i think that that's a big theme for you this month and knowledge so you're definitely learning a lot of things you saturn is you know messing with you apparently right now 
you know, if you needed to apply these things, study, pay attention to what you're learning. Don't just sweep, sweep these things under the rug and strength. You're getting through all of these things, Leah.